Dear friends, welcome to Learning About. In this video, I have come up with another great news, okay, and a very exciting news. So, Wipro they have once again announced uh, their Elite NTH uh, uh, 2022. Now, uh, so this Elite National Talent Hunt 2022, they are saying it is a fresher hiring initiative to attract the best of 2021 and 2022 engineering talents across the country, and they are saying that is, uh, by this they are enabling. The equal uh, employment opportunities uh, for India's deserving uh, engineering talent. Now, why they are saying this? Because so this is open for uh, any deserving and eligible uh, engineering graduate uh, from these two branches. Uh, okay, so irrespective of the uh, the colleges or the universities where you come from, uh, you are uh, eligible for this. Okay, so that's why they are saying it as the equal employment opportunity. Now, the salary offered is three point five lakhs. Now, uh, uh, please remember there is a bond that you have to sign. Okay, uh, the bond duration is like one year, and the bond value is seventy-five thousand. But uh, that seventy-five thousand you have to pay only on a pro rata basis, right? And uh, so, apart from the compensation, they have said that there will be flat bonuses uh, uh, post, you know, like uh, six months from joining. There will be about like uh, twenty-five thousand, uh, uh, and uh, so that compensation will be after twelve months of you know like bonus uh, payout. Uh, and uh, of course there will be uh, regular yearly increments and also there will be uh, there will be merging bonuses of 18th 24th and 36 months from joining so okay so subsequently like uh, so it's almost like every 6 months uh, uh, like uh, you'll be uh, getting a, uh, a a bonus okay now so the designation they are calling it as a project engineer how in accenture they are calling it as a associate uh, so it is an entry level you know like uh, uh, software engineering role so how in accenture they are calling it as the associate software engineer in uh, uh, in companies like uh, infosys and ibm they are calling it as a uh, system engineer so here they are calling it as the project engineer now uh, so as on uh, the day i'm recording this uh, the registration link is not at open but if you are watching the video on second or uh, uh, after you know like uh, uh, second so uh, the link will be in the description below and uh, so anyhow i'll be subsequently you know like uh, updating uh, this information uh, through the uh, telegram channel as well as you know like uh, the uh, youtube you know like uh, uh, posts etc right so so the registration start date is uh, may second of may and the la la last date to register is 22nd of may and the online assessment is scheduled from May 21 to June 5th. So you will get your uh, uh, date and time in any one of these days. So this is the screenshot of you know like the official notification uh, page. Now coming to the educational qualification percentage criteria, uh, the candidate should have a minimum of 60 percentage criteria in 10th, 12th, and graduation. Okay, so graduation it is either 60 percentage or 6 CGPA. Now only full time courses are permitted. Okay, no part time or correspondence or distance education courses. Now, uh, so B B Tech eligible, M E M Tech five year integrated courses eligible. Any branch, uh, all branches are eligible except fashion technology, textile engineering, agricultural and food technology. All other branches are permitted. And year of passing 2021 and 2022 only these two batches are eligible. Now, uh, so they have mentioned that uh, one backlog is allowed at the time of assessment uh, stage. Uh, uh, but I think probably this is applicable for only 2022 batch. But anyhow, so they have mentioned one backlog is allowed. And the uh, of course offer will be subject to all uh, uh, backlogs, you know, like being clear. And they have uh, mentioned that there will be a maximum of three. There can be a maximum of uh, uh, three years of gap, you know, like uh, between, you know, like the different academic uh, milestones. And uh, unfortunately, they have mentioned that uh, those candidates who are attended uh, the Wipro selection process in the last six months are not eligible for this particular uh, hiring. Now, coming to the selection uh, uh, process, uh, so first is the assessment test. It will be conducted by AMCAT Aspiring Minds. Uh, so, the total duration is like two hours and uh, eight minutes. The first uh, uh, part will be aptitude test for a duration of 48 uh, minutes. So you'll have logical ability, quantitative ability, and verbal ability. So uh, as far as logical and quantitative is concerned, we have you know like uh, videos based on previous uh, uh, questions. Uh, we have videos related to that. So you can you know like uh, watch those videos. All the relevant videos links are given in the description below. And as far as uh, the verbal ability is concerned, we have a practice platform wherein I have provided. Uh, the uh, previous questions you can click on that and practice so after that you know you will have I mean, subsequently you will have I mean, after that section is over you will have written communication test uh, for a duration of 20 minutes wherein you have to write essays 
now the third part will be online programming test for a duration of one hour wherein uh, usually like pro two programs for coding are given and you will be you can use any one of the pro programming languages like c c plus plus uh, java or python so those who qualify the online assessment will be called for the interview which they are calling it as the business discussion round okay so there will be a technical uh, interview and a hr interview so the uh, this is the selection uh, process uh, overview so first you go for the registration complete the online assessment those who qualify will go for the interview and those who uh, qualify in the interview will get the letter of uh, intent and then uh, so if you uh, agree on that so finally the offer letter will be released now how to apply so as i said you know like the link to apply uh, will be available from 2nd of uh, may uh, so if you are watching on, uh, on or after 2nd of may you can click on that it will be through superset uh, so if you click on this apply now if you i um, mean uh, since 2021 and 2022 batch most of you must be already having a superset uh, uh, pro uh, profile so you just enter your email id and then your password and then just click on that apply now uh, so it will tell you, you know, like if your application is accepted, it will tell you. It will reflect in the status. If it is not accepted, uh, it will give you the reason why it is not accepted. Okay, let's say for example, if you are uh, 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 from 2023 batch, okay, so it will say you are. I mean, you, this uh, this drive is not for 2023 and so on. It will give you the reason. Okay, so but if you are coming to, uh, to the uh, superset for the first time, you know, like so, uh, I have done a uh, an exclusive video on how to apply for the superset. Okay, so you can. Uh, 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 click on that video watch it you know like fully to uh, see how to register anyhow I'll just quickly uh, run through uh, and tell you how to register here so enter your email id uh, click on register and apply you have to enter your basic details like your name date of birth gender college primary email id mobile number etc click on uh, save next and then uh, after that you know like uh, you are login again you have to verify your email id you will get an otp then you have to you know like uh, give that and then uh, uh, confirm then you have to enter your contact details your uh, uh, most recent education then your previous education like 10th 12th uh, then if you have any internship and work experience you have to enter that and then you have to upload your uh, uh, photograph and then resume you have to upload in the pdf uh, uh, format right now if you have a, uh, any uh, uh, queries you know like please post your questions in the comment section uh, uh, below and once you are if you are creating the profile new once you after you complete the profile then click on apply now and then complete the registration process okay so in your application status it should get reflected that okay you have applied for this right now uh, if you like this video if you like this information that i have provided here uh, please click on the like button and uh, share it with your friends who may need it if you have not already subscribed to our channel please consider subscribing thanks for watching the video have a great day